Hi guys, Vex here. Welcome back to my uh, Delania, my single player world. I always end up calling my single player worlds Delania for some reason. Um, so yeah, I think... Um, I think now that I have my patron server up and I'm getting back into mapping, uh, I'm pretty much kind of done with this world. Um, I don't really feel like there's much else I want to do in vanilla Minecraft. Uh, I'm not going to delete it or anything. Uh, I mean, it still can have some pretty nice value. Like, I would love to maybe sample some of this terrain uh, for maps. Because um, I really like the way some of these areas look around here. And uh, or even some of my uh, my base areas. Um, I think it would be pretty cool uh, to, to use as, like, maybe part of a dungeon or something. And you might recognize, like, oh, hey, this is, uh, this was based on, I mean, I'm not just going to copy and paste it directly, but, uh, it might be like, oh, hey, I recognize this room layout. This is Vex's old base. So, I mean, that'd be kind of cool. Um, but yeah, I, I haven't played this in a quite some time. I just don't have the desire to just play vanilla Minecraft. Uh, the good news, though, is that 1.9, uh, I feel, is a pretty good update, and there's a lot of nice tools coming with 1.9 uh, for mapping. Um, we're going to have like custom loot tables. We're going to have uh, the new combat system. We're going to have uh, levitation. We're going to have some new enemies, the shulker, the endermite. Uh, we're going to have... Elytrias. Uh, we're going to have gliding mechanics, which is pretty cool for dungeon design. Um, so yeah. But I felt the need to make a, I guess, episode. Sort of ending the series instead of just like leaving it hanging so that you know what I'm doing in case you were following my Return to Minecraft series. Um... So yeah, this has been a great chance for me to just play 1.9 and get a feel for the gameplay. Because uh, it's definitely a, a pretty big change. And uh, I like this forest here. There's, there was my sand mining area. But if I messed with uh, Minecraft, I, like, I, I want it to be in a mapping or creative aspect. Like, uh, as far as the vanilla game goes. Now, I'd happily hop back into survival mode or adventure mode for a custom map, or a custom area or dungeon in a world. Um, so yeah, that's how I feel about that. Yeah, this is really nice terrain. I quite like this. Yep. Yeah, I'm definitely going to sample some of these. Where did my base go? I think I just got lost. Oh no, did I just get lost? I'd like to find my way back. Uh, wasn't it along the coast here? I could just fly into lava and... There we go. Oh, that looks nice. Um, the thing is, I, I like the way Minecraft looks with a render distance of 8. You get that nice pleasant fog effect at the air at the edges and not everybody's computer can handle maxing out the view distance so I, I'll probably try to work around a view distance of eight for future maps um, which kind of kind of like I would love for everybody to just always see be seeing 32 chunks away that'd be pretty cool but that's not realistic uh, so, as far as my Minecraft videos, I am going to move back into mapping and development videos. And uh, my next series, you're going to see me working on uh, a new, uh, my new custom world for my patron server. And 1.9 is getting pretty close to coming out, I think. Uh, it's probably going to be 
a, like a week or two. And then I um, have to see about what plugins I want, if any. I could just run a completely vanilla server. Um, people have been really nice uh, so far. Man, I love that view distance. And uh, I haven't needed as as many mods as I thought I would need, like the chest protect and stuff, because like the Demeter on my server is really nice. I haven't had any any problems at all. Which speaks well of um, you guys, the viewers, my fans, the people who, and my patrons. Uh, you guys are awesome. And you should uh, pat yourself on the back. <laughs> uh, so yeah, yeah, I guess that's it for this specific world. But there are so many worlds and so little time. Uh, that's from one of the pieces of fan art I saw. That was pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, I just um, I just don't feel the urge to just like be in survival mode and build a base and spend all the time grinding up the the resources. It just doesn't. Uh, I'm not feeling the appeal of that. Like I just want to go make maps and dungeons and stuff, uh, which is pretty pretty good news for you, I think, the viewer, if you enjoy that that kind of stuff. Uh, so yeah, I am going to go. I'm going to wrap this video up and I'm going to go start uh, hopping to MC Edit and I'm going to start making stuff. Until next time, as always, take it easy.